Captain Gray. Everyone will be in the library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now, and he hopes you'll make this place your home. Oh, please. What? Why? I know they can hear me through the door. Why do you think I want to be here? I don't. You two keep going on like this, and I'm banning wages. I'm serious. We'll play nice. Just a little friendly conversation, Sarah. That's all. All right. I don't know who she is. That's not a good first impression. I'm not sure I want to go in there and talk to her, quite frankly. But if I want to get rid of this thing and get my life back, I guess I have to, so... <sighs> I gotta admit, though, it's a nice place. A lot of natural wood. Brass inlays. Kind of cool. I'm a little disappointed. Wow, that's, that's transparent. I'm surprised that that's not. Anyways. All right, Fosco. You got me here. Well, let's just go in. Hi. We appear to have a visitor. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? Uh, the, you know, the pirate, there was, there was pirates, boss lady Lynn got mad because he wasn't staying. He couldn't come back. I gave, he gave the artifact to me, said I had a weird experience, so I had to come here. Vasco kidnapped me. We fought off some pirates. I killed the pirates. And now I'm here. Is that a good rundown? I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Thank you, Vasco. Uh, this is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. Walter. And if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neon. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. Thank you, Matteo. Now, let's focus on what's in front of us, shall we? Yes, we what shall. What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? First off, I want to take offense to this whole rock breaker thing. It was a it's just it was just a job. That's all it was. And then I do the job, I touch the thingy, and bright lights and music everywhere, and I passed out. Is that, how's that about? Is that is that a good reason? Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience. That's what he said. With less embellishment. See? Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. But honestly, Katya, if you expect us to believe in fairy... If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus... Can I just shoot them now? Noel. I think it's time we tested your theory. Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have... The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. I guess that's why I'm here. Take the dang thing. That's it. Just like... Unceremoniously just plop it on the table. Imagine. We thought step there away. were only two of them at first. Why? They're puzzle pieces. They're oh obviously going to fit together. That's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. Hey, that energy weird that's shit. between them. No manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proves... Easy, girl. Breathe. 
You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Godfrey? You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what? What are we going to do about our new friend here? I'll just be. Uh... <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? What I want to lead, life I want to lead in this little universe is one without debt. Can you make that? That's kind of distracting. Can you make that happen? This is all a little much. Right, tell me what happens next. How much you know about the artifact? You want me in Constellation? You want me in this group? What does that mean? What's, what's expected? And what do I get in return? We're all here because we're committed to exploring space. Humanity may have settled the stars, but that doesn't mean we should stop diving into the unknown. <sighs> you're just Beyond like that, Barrett, kind of weird. You'll be expected to use your own judgment, just like the rest of us. Hmm. My own judgment. So I can just go about my business and stay in the group. But you didn't mention pay. What 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 are these artifacts anyways? Because I don't know anything about them. And you obviously know something a little bit, a t smidgen. Individually, they're just odd hunks of metal. Yeah. Another oddity from the uncharted reaches of space. As to what they are, what they're building. Well, you'll be part of solving that puzzle now. Uh, suddenly, I lost my job. I get kidnapped to come here. This is this is a bit much. I gotta say, you got a nice place here. Very nice. But I got a mortgage. I got parents I gotta take care of. You, on the other hand, haven't offered me a thing other than an obligation from me to do something for you. I I need to think about this since you haven't actually offered me a job. Fair enough. But you need a place to stay in the city, right? Technically, yes. We owe you that much. Come find me when you're ready. And here. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. What did I get? In addition to credits... Yes, money is good. Why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just I mind got your one. Head. Lodge key added. 8,000 credits? And a constellation pack. Maybe I misjudged you. Um, okay. Huh. Let's see. Let me take a look at this. Constellation pack. Is it... How much is it better than what I've got? Compared to equipped. It's... It's pretty good. I gotta say, it's pretty good, actually. I'll equip it. Higher damage rating, resistance, the whole thing. Yeah. It weighs a bit more, but that's okay. Thanks. And the 8,000 credits goes a long way. I gotta say that. Um. I don't want to talk to her anymore. You. As much as I love uncovering new questions, I wouldn't mind a few answers now and then. It's a nice place. Where's my room and where can I stay? Do I want to talk to these guys now? I don't think so. Um. Um. Do you, I am at your service, Captain. Yeah, do you know where my room would be? Captain, now that you are a member of Constellation, I am at your service. No additional protocols necessary. Oh. Also, okay. given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, it might be beneficial to go over exploration outpost development in case you ever need to build a base for field research. 
Uh, ooh. Uh, I'll talk to you later, Bosco. I, there's things that we want to do, like figure out where I'm going to be staying. I don't want to talk to you. I don't. Huh. Maybe I do. Yeah. Hi. So, are you ready to get to work? Or was there something else? Uh... Bye. Bye. I, maybe I talk to this person. You seem reasonable and not crazy. That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for you right now. Yes, yeah, see? I guess a lot overwhelming now that I think about it. You're reasonable. I like you. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. That's great. Um, perfect. Sarah said something about a place for me to stay so I can stay here until I get things squared away, right? Planning on sticking around then? Good. Not for I long. Think I can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Great, super. Do the tour. Are we gonna go? Follow Noel. Um, hi. Stay safe, okay? Are we. Are we going? Should I just go find it on my own? We were going to do a, a tour? I guess we just go find our tour. I will take a look around without you, Noel. Maybe she's just, maybe she's absent-minded. She's cranky. Maybe she's absent-minded. I know everyone's excited by the artifacts, but we need to be as objective as possible and be aware of possible negative effects. Okay, you seem to know a lot about these artifacts. See you later. No tour. So we're not gonna get a tour or find out where my room is. Lately, I find myself spending more and more time here. Business has appealed to me, but this is exciting. I, I like your little sitting here. Can I, can I have a seat? Feel free to help yourself at the bar. I don't drink, but I feel like if I did, now would be a good time for one. Okay, so I can't. Hello there, Vasco. Greetings. Welcome you seem cheerful, but odd. Here, both boy. Are you doing okay? No, I'm not I've... sure anyone really asked yet. No, Don't I'm want not. You to think we're focused on the artifacts and nothing else. You matter too. You've done something really significant bringing that artifact here. I'm Mateo, theological Mateo. scholar by trade, but now, well, an explorer like you. It's really good to have you with us. I'm just staying just to figure out what's going on. What do you make of this vision I saw? What oh, constellation? These. Oh, what do you make about the vision I saw? Maybe I can get some answers this way without having to actually work for these people. I'm not gonna lie. I really wish I could have seen this for myself. It's hard to judge otherwise. Both you and Barrett saw something. I don't think that's a coincidence. No. Did it feel like it was trying to tell you something? I don't want to necessarily use the words divine revelation, but. You know, if the label fits. Divine revelation? I don't think it was trying to something. I know it's important. I can feel it. Maybe I'm just going crazy. All I know is I've never experienced. Yep, that's all I know. All I know is I've never seen anything like it. Uh, I haven't been in space that long to tell the truth, but never. I don't know anything about this. That sure lines up with everything else about these artifacts. It's all connected. We're gonna get to the bottom of this. We just need more data, which means more artifacts. More artifacts, really. You know, what brought you to here at Constellation? You know, they had the killer robot, Vasco, bring me here and I wouldn't, I couldn't deviate, no dances, no distractions. So Protocol Indigo brought me here against my will. What brought you to Constellation? Take care of yourself. 
curious feeling knowing oh. that you've seen something that no one else has. I forgot to ask him the that final you know question. Something no one that else you never does. expected to end up involved in something like this. Yeah, and what brought you to Constellation? Well, there was Remember some that question? overlap in interests. I'd spent years searching for religious relics from human history. I had made a really incredible discovery, only to lose it to a greedy corporation. So I tried to steal it back. In the process, I met Walter. Turned out he owned the corporation. So you're saying Walter's After a greedy? Long talk, we realized we had a lot in common. Like and greed. I was invited to join Constellation. Okay. All right. Gotcha. You're doing great out there. I'm not doing anything yet. Can I just sit? You cannot use this at this time. So only one person can sit at a time. You must be Walter. It'd be nice to have some place to sit and we can talk. Well, you seem I to be the money man in this whole thing. Breaker may have been a bit out of line. Thank you for the apology. I really appreciate that, but I have been called worse. You don't even know me. Yes, you're right. See? My frustrations lie more with Barrett. Not the first time his shenanigans have jeopardized one of our ventures. Not fair of me to take it out on you, especially since it would seem he made the right call this time. So, let's start over, shall we? Walter Stroud, CEO of Stroud Eklund, member of Constellation, and oft times grumpy old man. Very Welcome nice. Aboard. Very nice to meet you. Thank you for the proper introduction. See someone civilized. Um, let's watch the grumpiness of the future. I hope the drinks are at least free. That's a good free is good because that's more money. Yes, well, a stocked bar is a treat I think Constellation can afford. For now. But if you clean us out, you're on your own. Nah, By the likely. way, in addition to a place to stay, the Lodge has a wealth of modification and research equipment. Spacesuit oh. customization, pharmaceutical manufacturing, testing alien substances, the whole thing. You can even okay. fashion industrial pieces for large-scale projects, if you don't mind extracting a few raw resources from a nearby planet, that is. Okay. I'm a fan of self-reliance, so I encourage you to make use of the tools we have to build what you need. A nice workshop is good. Thank you. Craft or modify an item. Huh. Uh, this isn't where I'd expect to find a CEO. What's your role in Constellation? Let's just talk about the visions. I don't want to talk too much about you. We can talk about that later. I'm just more here about the visions to figure out what that is. And maybe I can get away from Sarah, the oddly enough, a very angry woman. Up until very recently, I'd likely have dismissed it as, I don't know, hallucinations. But now I'm not sure what to think. I don't suppose you have a history of this sort of thing, do you? Uh, no. Sure, I see lights and music all the time. It's a nonstop party in my head. No, nope, it's not. It's not. I haven't hit my head recently, if that's what you're asking. Not exactly, no. But I suppose it doesn't matter. You saw something. Barrett saw something. That's an unlikely coincidence. I'm no scientist. I leave that to the likes of Barrett and young Noel there. But I think we can all agree there's something unusual going on here. I agree. Frankly, this is the most exciting thing that's happened in years. And what? I mean, the, the kid's a religious fanatic. I get that. What's your role here? Me? <laughs> Why, I'm the wallet. You're just Someone the guy I want to talk to. My success in business doesn't mean much if I can't put it to good use. I don't pretend to have the daring of Ms. Morgan or the smarts of young Mateo, but I can make sure that they have the resources they need. Okay, and how about the resources I would need? Seen, those resources aren't being wasted. We're onto something big here. Hmm. What kind of company is Stroud Eklund? If I decide not to stay with Constellation, can you give me a job? We're most well known for ship manufacture. No expense spared. If you want the best and can afford it, you choose Stroud Eklund. Unfortunately, our success means you'll sometimes see Stroud Eklund ship modules on less than reputable vessels. They covered them. The bastards. 
I've tried to convince the United Colonies we can help in that regard, but they're married to Deimos Star Yards, and those old salts are stuck in the glory days. You know, I am a pilot. If you need someone to jump in a ship, take it someplace else for a modest fee and deliver to your customers with a smile on my happy little face, I'd be more than happy to help you out. See, simple job, pays we pretty well. We can always continue this some other time. And I think we shall. Bye. All right, I guess I'm gonna have to do the tour on my own. So, okay, I guess we just kind of explore on our own here. You really aren't gonna let it go. Mothvine. I'm so busy with our work here that I don't think about it much these days. Never mind. Did I scan the mothvine? I guess not. No, I guess I really can. There's nothing to scan. People? Look. There are things on the. It's scanning certain things. Okay. What is that? I hope Barrett makes it back to us. I know he gets into trouble all the time. Not a good compass. I hope you are satisfied still. with the quarters available to you. Uh, I don't know because because the woman didn't conduct the tour she has said she was going to do. So she may be a little bit absent-minded. Do you think the artifact had something to do with that? I hope you are satisfied with the quarters I'll available to it, you. I'll go figure it out my, on my own. Huh. Locked. You lock. Okay. Lodge key. New Atlantis. That goes outside. I'll, I'll just find my own way. All right, someone's been sleeping. Owned. Okay, so it's that one's. Someone's been sleeping in that bed. Ah, hallway. Owned. Okay. This is the bar. Okay. What is this? A cooking station. It seems like an odd place to have the stove inside the main room. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. What is that? It's just a bowl. Let's check out what's behind the bar. Okay, the taps are dry, Walter. The taps are dry. It's so young. Lots of wine. So where's all the good booze? All you have here is wine, Walter. There's no, there's no good booze here. There's no cabinets either. Okay. Um, I guess we'll just, I get, we can play darts in here and drink wine. Where's the good booze? See, they also have a linen rack in here. It really ruins the aesthetic when you have such functional devices in here. I'm just saying. I wonder what that looked like when it was alive. Check this room. Ah, storage room. Gotcha. I won't be sleeping there. There's no bed. Empty. Hmm. I like this room. Whose room is this? Oh, and this is someone's room. I just look. This can't be open. I guess maybe that would be rude if I start opening people's locks and things. All right, check this door. Conference room, gotcha. Nice room. Hey, it's a bed and it's not owned. It must be mine. Okay, cool. There's storage. 
There's nothing in it. It doesn't say how much it would hold either. Like it's unlimited storage. Huh. Chrono Mark case. Can I just open it? I don't want to take the case. All right. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. That's that room again. Maybe we should close some of these doors. And just leave mine open since the only one I know. There we go. Okay. So, Walter mentioned a shop. Where is the shop at? Yeah, we checked that room. That's outside. So, where's the shop? Ah, uh, in the basement. Nice basement. Ah, functional basement. Very good. Research lab. Weapons workbench. Basic workbench. Industrial workbench. Mission board. Really? Locate amphibious foothold in Groombridge. 10,000 credits. We're looking for an experienced explorer to locate a planet with amphibious foothold in the Groombridge system. Hmm. Locate disease biosphere in Maheo. Locate slushy subsurface seas in Bernard Star. I mean, these are all pretty good. They pay well. Well, this one doesn't. Survey an entire planet for a thousand? Doesn't seem like a very good deal. What else we got down here? Pharmaceutical lab. Another cooking station. Who's living in the basement? Just saying. Forever human, I don't get that. Can I bring the chairs up? I may need to have more space. Bathroom. I don't want to be stealing anything that belongs to these people. This thing is pretty extensive. I'm impressed. That opens to the well. I saw that on the directory. The well. Okay. Generalized storeroom? Lock is too difficult. Oh, it's master level lock. I thought it was a master... Master key. Okay. Gotcha. 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 Alright. So. Said to modify. Can I modify my weapons? Weapon workbench. What happens if I. Optic. Medium scope. Research required optic and laser mod 2. A reflex site. So... I have adhesive. It's on the ship. Or do I need to bring them down to me? How do I pull... I have to bring them to this workstation? I can't just access the ship. I guess that makes sense. All right, that's kind of annoying. Muzzle. Put a suppressor on there. Muzzle mods two. Muzzle mods one. They want me to modify these things, but I can't do anything with them. I don't have the skill. Yeah, I can't says to modify these things. I don't have anything increases accuracy, recoil control, and range at the cost of aim down sight speed. Oh, I can put a scope on that. Standard barrel. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Well, that's cool and all, but I don't know how to do anything. Ah, 
I am at your service, Captain. How do I contact my parents? I need. It's been I need quiet around here ever since Vladimir went to live on the I full time. I I need to talk to my dad. I need some advice. Ever since I got here, this has felt like home. These people are family. I hope it feels that way for you too. It, it might. But I had to go find my own room. I'm not really feeling welcome. Oh right, that. Vision. If we were approaching this rationally. I suppose we'd call them visual and auditory hallucinations. Okay. What you perceived as lights and music could be overloaded neural input. Your brain's attempt to make sense of something, an energy surge, some other phenomenon. Are you a doctor? That's a very clinical explanation of, of what I saw. Very reasonable explanation, but I will say it's kind of clinical. There might be a reasonable explanation. I wasn't there. I didn't see what you saw. I'm just not in a position to say for sure. That's okay. Now that this has happened to both you and Barrett, we can know to maybe expect it in the future. Be a little more prepared. We're all in this together now, right? Right. I'm not in it. Stay together. safe, okay? Gotcha. Gotcha. Um, I hope you are satisfied with the quarters okay, available we, to you. Thanks. All right, you folks take care. I'm going to go hit the town. Honestly? See your parents at Pioneer Tower. See? It's almost like the game was reading my mind. See Landry Hallfield on the new and last budget mortgage. E Gods! Okay, I'm here in New Atlanta, so let's let's talk about this. Um, no. Miscellaneous. All activities. See your parents. Let's go talk to Dad first. Figure out where Pioneer Tower is. Is that like the old folks' home? I don't know. Let's see. Oh, this map. This map. Pioneer Tower. So it's. Oh god. So, Pioneer Tower that way? Okay. I really need to talk to Dad about this. I'm glad he's here on New Atlantis. How do I get there? Alright. Um, I'm lost. I'm lost in the big city. He tells me I don't want to go that way. Oh, I'm glad to see the jump pack still on. Is it jump? Yeah, it's on. Okay. Good to know. Residential district. Okay, I get the lay of the land, maybe see the city without going on the on the railway. Okay, I mean, nice place. The water looks a little thick, but who am I to say? Values of the vanguard: honor, loyalty, self-reliance in all your actions. Ah, I do have to take the railway. Okay. Then I'm proud to welcome you to the Vanguard. Now, you all have your assignments. Get out there and show them what the UC is made of. Supra yeah, and I, Ultra. Yeah, good luck to them. Good luck to them. You go out there and risk your life for the UC. Have fun doing that. It's a good thing I have this neurochip in my brain telling me where to where to go for things, or I wouldn't know. Is it an artificial intelligence that tells me these things? I heard something about something. I wonder if I'll miss New Atlantis when Tony and I leave. No, probably not. You're a janitor. You're like a normal working person here. What's your deal? I have a feeling today's going to be a great day. Don't you agree? Uh, it hasn't been great so far. How's it been going for you? 
Oh, hi there. I'm doing great. How about you? Um, I'm struggling to find meaning in my life. I'm struggling to find anything. What's with this guy? What's with him? I'm struggling to find meaning. Now I've lost my job. People are trying to wrangle me into doing things. I'm trying to find some meaning in my life. Hmm. We've all been there, I think. Maybe not to my Maybe point. Maybe you just need to find a goal to strive towards. I've been trying to save up enough money so that I can go explore the settled systems with my boyfriend, Tony. I think we're finally getting close. Good luck. Good luck. Um, how's it going so far? And you want to leave New Vegas? New Atlantis? New Vegas. <laughs> um, you want to leave New Atlantis? Why? Other than you have a crappy job? Tony and I want to see what else is out there. I love my job, but there has to be more to life than just being a janitor in New Atlantis. There is. You can crack rocks you? on, you on desolate worlds. Uh, enough for a lifetime. That's amazing. I'm so jealous. One day you'll have to tell me and Tony all about them, okay? Okay. Um, anything you recommend doing in New Atlantis? Always well, talk to the employees of the depends. city. They know where the are best things are. Are you a or a shopper? Uh, I need to buy some new gear. I do enjoy spending food credits from time to time. You should check out the commercial district. There's some cool shops there. Okay. And if you want a whole new look, there's even an enhance. I kind of like my look. What do you mean? Uh, you look a little tired. Really? Well... I guess you're right. I'm feeling a bit run down. Why is that? I really love my job, but it's hard work and long hours. I could definitely use a Terracino from Terra Brew right now. Uh, I'm I'm not gonna get you a coffee. I'm just not. Maybe some other time. Ah, uh, no worries at all. I was just thinking out loud. Don't trouble yourself on my account. Uh, how's it going? I thought I already asked this. You know, it's one of those days where all I can think about is food. I wonder if my boyfriend will take me to Chunks later. I've seen Chunks. Take care of yourself. They're like cubed things. So the Commerce District, if I want to buy some new gear. But I remember they saying the Arsenal was in the Residential District. Haha. <laughs> Haha. <laughs> Where was the second, the military surplus? Pioneer Tower is that way. Reliant Medical, okay, Pioneer Tower, Residential District. Hello, officer. Getting late, I wonder what the city looks like when it's nighttime. What the hell are these? Luggage storage? I don't get that. Fancy. Oh my god, elevator music. Make it stop. Make it stop. It doesn't know where my dad is. Huh. That doesn't do anything. Um. So it just kind of knows where my dad is? Hi, Dad. What? Well, I'll be. Yeah, I'm back. Honey, we got ourselves a visitor. I'll get the coffee brewing. Oh, my God. Oh, you about gave me a heart attack. Not that we're not thrilled to see you, son, but I, I thought you were under contract with Argos Extractors. Is everything all right? Yeah, about that, Dad. <sighs> See, I got fired. It it wasn't my fault. I didn't do anything wrong. They said I was doing a great job, but they let me go. Um, don't assume I. It's bad news. I got a big promotion. I'm in constellation now. I'm not in constellation. They're they're offering me a job with constellation. I don't know if it's the right thing to do. 
And am I going to have male pattern baldness as I get older? Come again? Constellation? Is this one of those candid camera vids? A joke? My child is a member of Constellation. I didn't I accept the job yet. Special. Didn't I always say that? That you were meant for great things? Great things. Uh, we'll see how this Constellation thing plays out. I don't know anything. But I am surprised that you know about Constellation. I never heard you talk about it before. Is that because since you moved here to the retirement tower, you heard about them? You went down the mass, saw that big building that's all by its lonesome with a locked door? Is that what you... how you learned about them? Well, I know what I've read about in the news. The Explorers. Years ago, there was a stretch where Constellation was in fashion. People would gossip about them all the time. Got it. I, I must say, it's been a while since I've heard anything about them, though. Glad to know they're still around. Uh, we'll see how this Constellation thing works out. I'm, I don't know if I want to take the job, quite frankly. They're a little strange. I don't know if they pay well. And you and I both know money's an issue. Right, Mom? Oh, in life, you need to celebrate the victories you get. Yeah, ever since Because the you don't know when the next one's coming. Oh, but you didn't give me any notice. If I'd known, I'd have your favorite meal in the oven. Oh. Uh, and your room is just a mess. Although, that's how you left it. Yeah, sorry about Easy, that. Easy, honey. Let the boy catch his breath. Why don't you settle in? You know you're always welcome. She, she's going to go make something. Dad, I I want to talk about money. You seem to be doing all right here, though. I guess the money I'm sending you weekly is paying off. But the money you sent home? Yeah. Well, it means a lot to both of us. I'm glad to hear it. You know, Dad, I still can't believe it. Constellation. The stories make them seem so exotic, so, well, romantic, almost. But how is it for real? You liking it? I don't know. It, it's... I'm still wrapping my head around being invited to join, honestly. I don't know, but... I don't think it's for me, Dad, but it beats mining. Well, give it time. It's a huge transition. You're telling me! The Constellation's one of the only groups I know still diving into the real mysteries of the universe. Pretty exciting, if you ask me. I've got some news of my own. You are now officially looking at a retiree. I knew that. Taught my final class last Thursday. The faculty threw me a party and everything. It's too bad you weren't here then. You could have had some cake. Space cake would be nice. Um, congrats, Dad. I kind of knew you were going to retire anyways when you moved here. I gave it my good old college try. <laughs> you see what I did there? Yeah, it's a dad Enough joke. About Don't that. do that again, please. Anything you want to talk about before you have to go? I mean, stay. Stay as long as you like, but I imagine you're all excited to get to discovering. How are things going, Dad? Retirement's treating me well, but there are some days I almost missed the classroom. Almost. Don't say anything to your mom about this, but... She got some work done at Enhance. She keeps looking younger every I day. Would I would never tell her. mention a mind. thing. Got any plans? Planning a proper, honest to goodness vacation. Good. Nothing too fancy. I've been promising your mom a trip for years, and I got no excuses now. Your mother's been sending me links all day about such and such deals and excursions, but it'll be good to get out. You guys need anything? Is the money doing all right for you? You know, it's supposed to be us taking care of you, right? Yeah, but I'm the only one making money now. I'd like to say we'll pay you back the money you sent home. There's no need, Dad. Well, I appreciate it. We appreciate it. More than you know. All right. I'm going to talk Take to Take care, Mom. kiddo. He seems encouraged by the whole thing. Where's the tissue paper? You don't know where that is? Where's my room I at? knew where it was. Top shelf of the pantry. But it's not there anymore. No. So I'm guessing this was my room. Ago. 
How do you expect me to know where anything is if you keep moving them all the time? Oh, God. You should pay attention. I was a football fan. Made really poor calculations. Who knows if those are right? So this is the way I left my room. And this is mom and dad's room. Okay. Can I get in the shower? No. Be nice if we could. Mom. There's just so much to do in New Atlantis. I want your opinion. Dad told me he's real excited. You seem excited, but I want to make sure. I still can't get over you being here. And it's not even Mother's Day. So, I gotta ask. Is there anyone special in your life? With you being in Constellation now, I imagine you are quite the catch. I... You know, ever since the divorce, I haven't been really looking for anyone. I don't want to be that one to talk to you. Nothing to report. I don't want to talk about this. Just so you know, your dad cannot wait to be a grandpa. Kind of early for so that. So don't keep him or me waiting too long. I, I know. I know. I won't get into more right now. Thank you, Mom. I know you didn't live in this apartment long, but I want you to consider this your home away from home. Your bed is always yours. No questions asked. I, I got a minute. It's a little small. I will ask questions, but you can stay here no matter the answers. Thanks, Mom. No bother at all. Stay as long as you like. Anything you want to talk about, dear? What are you doing these days, Mom? Now that we're both retired, you mean? Yeah. I, I keep trying to push your father to do things. Dance lessons, vacation, take some courses. I'm really interested in early colonial art. But uh -huh. he's just... Happy as a clam reading in his chair for hours. Wants to know the history of every little thing. Well, he was a college it's professor. Nice I'm not surprised by that. Both, though. Any gossip? Anything you want to talk about? Well, one of your old classmates made junior VP at Gal Bank. Really? Their father was bragging for hours. Can't wait to tell him about Constellation. Okay. Regina, I the president of... Oh, I know all about her. Well, she's making me redo the whole report from scratch because she gave me the wrong information. You worked on that for days. I so know. So dad's retired, but she's not. I swear not. next election, I'm stepping down. I, I can't stand her. Are we looking for solutions or sympathy? What? Oh, what's this about? Fred from the poker group said 90% of all marital strife would I'm go away if you away just slowly. know whether you need to offer help or a friendly ear. Fred's a wise man. I suppose sympathy. Then that Regina is a monster. There ought to be a law. Damn straight. Okay. Mom, Dad, great talking to you. Gots to go. Enjoy the money. Why is the toilet paper on the floor?